F I N Good, Finn! I am here in session with my client. If you're new to my channel, my name is Anna Turi, and I'm a registered behavior technician in the state of Florida. So today is gonna to be a little bit different of a video. I'm super excited for it. I've never done anything like it. I've been recently sent a new toy that I have brought to session today. Wow, cool. Here you go. He's on break right now. Um, and I'm gonna test it out with him to see how it works. Um, if it's too hard for him, if it's too easy, if he can learn how to use it. You know, he might not get it right away, but can he learn? Yes. So we're gonna try that out today. Did Anna bring you a new toy today? Yes. Yes, are you excited? Of course. Of course. It's gonna be for the end of session though, guys. The new toy that I'm talking about is this one. This is the Osmo Math and Wizard Airships. This video isn't sponsored at all. Um, they just sent me the toy to try out and I thought that I would try it out to see if it would be something that we could use as reinforcement um, in sessions. And I know a lot of us have kiddos that are older and I get asked a lot what we can bring for them and this is a really cool option. So anyways, because this is such a cool toy, I am going to save this for the end of session. We're working for it with tokens so he can earn this, right? Okay. Okay, so um, we're gonna do some work in between. We're gonna go through our session like normal. And at the very end, we will test it out. Let me see your Osmo. Let me see my Osmo later. Listen, we're gonna work for this. Okay. You wanna work for this? Yeah. Yeah, he's so excited. He also wrote about it in his uh, journal that we do every morning, I'll show you. Okay, so today, this is what he wrote in his journal. So it says, today I feel, he circled happy, and he wrote because Anna has a new toy. <laughs> That's why he felt happy today, and then he drew the Osmo box. So he's pretty happy today, guys, and we'll go ahead and uh, review it and see how it works out later. This is what we're up to right now as far as our break. This is a cute little sensory box with um, dried Daddy. black beans and um, some space stuff. Some space action in our IKEA sensory table, so we'll check back in with you. Sleep. Yes. So, yes, you got it. Fly. Good. Juggle. 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 Yes. Okay, buddy. Good job. Here you go. Very good. We're getting closer to getting Osmo. Jig. Hi. One. Wig. Wig. It's one of our words that we did today, remember? Two. Two. B. Bugs. Yes, bugs. And. Yes. And. Yes. Rug. Rug. Very good, bud. Okay, next. Ready? Let me see your finger, please. Fish has the three cups. He does. So we say, pup. Pup has three pup. Cups. Cups. Yeah, good job. Oh my goodness. You're reading. Ready? Next one. Where's your finger? No. Mac. Mac has four hats. Yeah, you got it. Okay, next. Da. Wait, dot. Dot has five pots. Pot. The end. Very good, high five. What? I have five. You have five. We need five more stickers, okay? And what are we gonna get? The Osmo. The Osmo, all right, we're gonna keep working, okay? Alrighty guys, so we have um, done a ton of work and he's doing fantastic. Right now we have six 
um, tokens on the board, on his token board. So we're almost at the 10 for him to earn the Osmo. We're taking a quick little break. We just had lunch and he's reading about Pokemon. And I hate this mask because I like inhale it. So sorry about that. <laughs> what a cool book. I like your book. Is that Pokemon? What is that? The wolf. The wolf? Yes. Cool. Let's see how we can say the name. Poochie Enna. <laughs> Poochie Enna. Poochie Enna. If anybody knows Pokemon and I'm butchering the names, please forgive me. Okay, go ahead. These are the options. Web, very good. Okay, what else? Jam, you said it right. What goes in between? Sound it out. Jam. Jam. Very good, jam. That was also one of our words. What is this? The net. The net, correct. The net. So what goes in between? Net. Net. Good job, buddy. Excellent. Good. Okay, and what about that one? What is that? Bed. 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 High five, Panda. Sticker. Here you go. I did it. You did it. All righty, guys. We got the 10 stars here, and he also won a medal. Show me your medal. Okay. My medal. Why did you get this medal? Because you did it? I did it. Good job, buddy. You did it. Congratulations. High five. Are you excited? We're going to do the Osmo now. So we have, this is where, this is his stuff. And I also have the iPad. This is also his. This, I, this, um. You're my, I did it. <laughs> you did it. Yeah, you did. I did it. Good job. So this, um, case is from Osmo. This is also a case from Osmo. This is his, this is mine. Excuse me, can you sit down, please? Let's sit down. Thank you, thank you so much. All right, can you open this up for me? Open it up. Let's get it all set. You're gonna see he knows exactly what to do. Open it up, awesome. All right, this, he's so excited. All right, can you show them how to set up the iPad, please? Here you go. Okay. Set it up. Perfect, so that's the Osmo stand. And then we're gonna put this on there too, right, buddy? You open up the Osmo case and you place this little reflector in. All right, now let's show them the app. Which one is it? That's right, Math Wizard. We're gonna go right in here to add postcard. So we're gonna go to add postcard. There you go, go ahead and place the postcard. A new discovery. Can you me? Oh my goodness! Click on it. Play airships. Play so we're gonna see how this works, guys. I have never done yes. this. Yes! Help me build an airship? See, so sure, Rupert, we'll help you. So this is the box right here. So it says, for six to eight year olds, grades one and two. This is the Math Wizard and the Amazing Airships. So what your child will learn. Building and balancing equations. Addition and subtraction practice. Solving for an unknown value, introduction to al algebraic thinking. Wow. Not included the iPad or Fire tablet and the Osmo base. So there you have it. All right, now I'm gonna try and teach him. So that's one package. Here we go, another package. That's right. Yep, good job. What? See, they pop out. That's the only corrective feedback I can give right now. These pop out, so be a little frustrating. Here we go. Here's another package. Alrighty, and then here's another package. So we're trying to reach four. There we go. Uh, buddy, so now we're gonna need the cargo piece, which I think is in here. Four. Nope, buddy, no, no, no. Can you please listen for Anna? Can you wait for Anna, please? Thank okay. you. Thank you, thank you so much. Look, put this underneath. Yep, yeah, good job. All right, now, can you do me a favor? Yeah. Look at me, this is where the explaining comes in. Let me see four fingers, please. 
fingers, please, like this. Four, okay, and you, this hand too, four fingers. Four fingers, okay, wait, yep, good job, good job, perfect, keep it, keep it like that. Four, plus four, so let's count, one, two, Eight. eight, okay, we have eight here, okay? Four plus four is eight, so we need eight balloons, buddy. Eight balloons, eight balloons. so look, four, okay, plus four equals eight. Go, let's see if it works. <gasps> All right, I definitely need to be here next to him. We're basically doing addition right now. Um, he's gonna need my help. This was the first time I ever explained it to him. I think eventually he would definitely understand and practice math and have fun at the same time. So every kiddo's different. This would probably be for older kiddos, those that are more advanced in math. This is the box that it comes in. It's so cute. I mean, it's it's meant to like be kept. Like, you're not gonna toss this out. So it's like magnetic right here and then it keeps the board that comes with it. And then these are the pieces that you'll use. Um, a little bit of um, setup directions, what's inside. So I, I do enjoy that they, it brings a box to keep everything into. Look how cute it is. Alrighty guys, so I like it. I do like it. I do think at the end of the day, it's gonna be too hard for him overall. So the game gets harder the more that you work. So even in the beginning, I he could do it, but he needed my help. So I would say for him, it would be too difficult for him. But he does have other Osmo games that are really, really great for him. And I would love to show you those um, sometime. Now, if I were to bring this game to my girls, the ones that I have now, I'm leaving to them now, this would be perfect for them. I'm pretty sure they would be able to understand, follow. They're at that first and second grade level um, as far as understanding math. So I think it would be a, a really good game for them. But anyways, guys, that is my overall review for the amazing airships. Thank you, Osmo, so much for sending it to me. Like I said, I'm not getting paid to make this video. Um, I did ask you guys on my Instagram story if you'd like me to review it for you, and the majority said yes. So if you're not following me on Instagram, go ahead and do so, behavior underscore works. I like to chat with you guys on there, especially through my stories. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for a lot more content that's coming out very soon. Thank you for being patient with me as I have a lot on my plate at the moment, but things are coming as far as ABA source and videos that I'm working on. I'm working on three right now at the same time. So have a great rest of your day and I'll see you later. Bye. Myself. What a wonderful world.